Hello, Mr. Elphick. How are, How are you doing? Very good, yourself? Yes, good. And what do you think about uh, the extension now to October the 31st? Well, my own view is we should just leave. We should just leave? Yeah, Britain stands ready. We are ready for um, deal or no deal. I think we should just get on with it and oh, make sure that we leave the European Union, yeah. uh, honour the referendum, respect the referendum, yeah. make sure that we get on. Now, I know you don't agree with that, but and you uh, have a passionate campaign I against do. that. Yes. Uh, but my constituents are very clear, and they keep emailing me saying, I haven't been left yet, yeah. and I think that's a fair question. So I'm doing everything I can to make sure that we leave, um, because that's what people decided in a referendum. So what are you going to do now then? Because we're obviously not leaving. Are no. you going to push for this hard Brexit? I don't think we, uh, it's about a hard Brexit. I think it's about just making sure that we leave the European Union. And yeah. whether we leave with a deal, whether we leave without a deal, the key thing is that we now need to leave. You know, despite everything, that the referendum now was almost three years ago. People have changed their minds. Even Rhys Mogg has changed his mind. The government does U-turns, well, so after mind? three years, well, why Jacob, can't the has, British people? Has Jacob rees changed his mind? Well, he's now back, he was back in the PM's deal, well, which I you were all dead against. And I backed the PM's deal yeah. as well on the third vote, because I just think we need to just get it over the line yeah. and leave. But we already have the best deal. We are never going to get a better deal. Well, I think the best uh, you deal know is, that. And I, and I voted it for the last time. Yeah. So you voted for it and it came back again, but the important thing is, deal or no deal, Time has come for us to leave the European Union and move on. We've got other things to discuss, like schools, schools, policing, okay. border control. So I'm very passionate, but now we now need to move on. Now, I hope the Prime Minister might bring that deal back again. If she does, I'll support her. But if she doesn't, I just think we need to leave. I think endless extensions, which creates yeah. more uncertainty, and it's now better to leave, deal or no deal, so at least we know where we stand as a nation and we can all collectively move on. That's one last quick one. Mark Francois and Andrew Bridgen are not supporting May's deal, so there's a split in the ERG. I don't accept that, but Mark Francois can speak for himself, Andrew Bridgen can speak for themselves, but myself, I've been happy to support the uh, meaningful vote on the third occasion. I'm very keen that we leave, mm. deal or no deal, yeah. and I do think we now need to move on. And he must give me but, sign now, me to okay. move on and go, and go in here. But, but lastly, she, she gets lots of votes. We just get the one in three years, really. That's not democracy. Well, I think we've had a referendum, the decision is made, and as I keep saying, we now need to move on. Thank you very much. Thank you.